Hey, welcome back. So yeah, I mean, I knew this would happen. Like, once I start doing the dating stuff, it's going to take over everything. Um, I haven't even started yet, but... Well, yes, I did. I had the Zoom date. Um, so, but now I, I'll talk about the Tinder person. It's kind of interesting because this was the person that I talked to like a month ago. And when I did that Tinder video... Um, and she was like, oh, I don't think, like, I, I like talking to you, but, like, I don't think I'm ready to meet or... And she basically, like, kind of cut off communication. She was like, I just need time by myself. And, um, so, yeah, I, I thought she was gonna, she was saying, like, goodbye forever, pretty much, to me. That's what that came across, but... A couple days ago, she messaged me, and it's good because, I mean, I'm not really talking to too many other people, so it's nice that she thought about me, and she was like, let's keep talking, so we did that, and then, actually, she was the one who initiated this time the coffee thing, which is interesting. I asked her the first time, like, to go somewhere, but then this time she was like, oh, you want to get coffee? Okay, that's the thing I have to talk about. Coffee. I said yes, coffee. I don't drink coffee. I guess it was good that I did that, um, that lunch with the pastor guy. Because I kind of, I still don't know how to order coffee, and I'm worried that it's going to be, like, embarrassing. I'm just worried that, like, it'll come across, like, a little bit, like, I was a little bit dishonest about liking coffee. I never told her I liked coffee, but I'm just, like, I don't know. You know what I mean? <laughs> like, what if I go there, and so we go to get coffee, and then she's, like, I order it, and then I order kind of, like, in a weird way, where she's, like, you didn't order any milk with your coffee, and I'm, like, and then I would be, like, Oh, yeah, I don't really drink coffee that much. And then she would say, oh, like, why did you want to come get coffee with me if you didn't like coffee? I'm like, oh, well, but I kind of, I mean, I like coffee. I just don't drink it that much. And then it would be a thing of maybe like, oh, why don't you go back and order milk? And I'd be like, oh, I don't want to do that. <laughs> um, I'm worried about the coffee date part of it all. Um, how's my ammo doing? Whoops. I think I'm doing okay. Everybody's health is good. I think, uh, I think I'm just gonna sit there. Should I try to flank them from the other side? I don't know. Who, who, I wanna do, here, here, like this. And then I have... I don't want to waste it on the wall. Eh, I'm going to do it. Okay. And then I'm going to do this, and we're good. Okay, 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 okay. <sighs> what should I wear? Oh, God. It's, this is real. It's really happening, and I don't know what to wear. <laughs> I'm just gonna wear. I, I have a. I have two black shirt T-shirts that I like. I'm like, okay, black T-shirt. That's good. It's like clean, clean black tee. Is good. And then I have my jacket that I like wearing. I think that's good enough. Like casual coffee, blue jeans, black tee. That's good, right? I'm just worried about the coffee part. What am I gonna order? No, don't do that. I don't wanna do that. Come at me. Oh, that was stupid. Uh, whatever. Now I'm gonna be stuck here. <gasps> she has high magic defense. Yeah, 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 we're okay. 
Um, I don't know. Anything else about the Tinder girl or just talk about maybe therapy? Um, I don't feel super nervous. I have to go. Did I mention like I'm doing this uh, Thanksgiving thing tomorrow with the church? So that's a thing that I'm kind of thinking about, like, um, like at least I have to get through that first before I even have to worry about the date. So like, it's not even on my mind right now, but I'm not feeling social anxiety. I'm not, Ooh, gotta suit up. Um, like the, the world ending dread of like, I'm gonna meet this person and it's gonna be terrible. And what am I doing? couple years ago that's how I would feel um, and I don't feel that way anymore so that's good right I'm just gonna wait do this obviously do this How much time do I have? I have like five minutes. Um, yeah, so therapist. I'll talk about that real quick. No, 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 no. Well, yeah, okay. <laughs> um, I really like this therapist. She's, um, I mean, part of it I know is that I'm not feeling depressed. So it's not really fair to the other therapist because she was dealing with a lot more, um, like it was a higher degree of difficulty dealing with me back then because like I was so depressed and I didn't know what to do and she wasn't helping me. So like, oh, I don't like you. I didn't, <laughs> I liked her. It was okay. Um, but I, I do feel just like I'm c connecting better with this. She understands me a little bit better. I don't know. Like what I respond to and what I, what helps me, because this is a perfect example. We were talking about my parents um, and I've talked about my parents a billion times with the other therapist and I never got anywhere. Like, I don't like talking with my parents and I want to do a better job. And the other therapist would always just kind of say like, oh, like you're just putting too much pressure on yourself or whatever. And it's never helped me. That never helped me. Um, but this therapist so we went through and she was like would you tell your parents that you went on a virtual date and I was like no never never I would never tell them and then she was kind of talking about like oh why why wouldn't you tell them don't wouldn't it make them happy I'd be like yeah yeah it would make them happy probably but I kind of went through in my head and I told her like, it just, I'm imagining talking to them and telling them and it just feels bad. And we kind of talked more about that feeling and she was, I was basically like, oh yeah, it's kind of embarrassment. Like I would be embarrassed. And so we got to the point where it was like, could you be honest about that? Like you don't have to tell them that you're dating, but just like, could you tell them that it, whenever you want to tell them you're dating you don't because you're embarrassed about it and i'm like that's much better like i could definitely at least see myself doing that just calling my parents or maybe even texting them and being like hey i want to tell you something but like before we talk i just i don't want you to to make a big deal about it or i don't want you to to, to get like too crazy about it um I just want to tell you, like I told my therapist, and I feel like I should tell you, like that I went on this date. I should tell them about the date on Saturday, probably, because that's like a more traditional, like a real date. We're going to get freaking coffee. I've never done that before. <laughs> I'm like a normal person. Thank you, Tinder friend, for making me feel like a real boy. <laughs> I feel real. No, that's nice. 
I mean, we'll see how it goes. <laughs> I just can't, I, for some reason, I'm feeling optimistic about it. Like, I'm going to do this thing and maybe it won't go well, but I won't be feeling worse after than I did before. Like, nothing will ever feel as bad as last year. It, I'm Not nothing, but um, this date is not going to make me feel as bad as last year, like when I hated my job and I wasn't talking to anybody, like that whole thing. So I'm feeling optimistic about like, well, it could be bad, but it's not like, I don't know. I'd, I'll just come home and play Resident Evil and it'll be fine. Who cares? <laughs> That's how I feel. <laughs> like, I'll just go back to doing what I was doing before anyway, I guess. Um, where'd your friends go? <laughs> Let's get him. If I go here, will he attack me? I hope not, because she might die. Whatever. I don't like these small corridors. I can't advance. They're, they're pinching me into a bottleneck. Okay, that's it for today. Oh, sure. Okay, um, but yeah. Well, let's try to kill this guy. I'll kill this guy. Let's do it. Come on. But yeah, I, I liked talking to the therapist about that. And um, I felt that, that felt like a little, like kind of like progress. I don't know. I was always so frustrated talking to the other therapist. I never felt like I was making progress, even though I was. It never felt satisfying to talk to her. <laughs> um, and I always kind of thought that that was maybe just like, well, it's your anxiety. But I like this new therapist, so that's good. Uh, okay, 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 okay. <laughs> going to happen? What if I do this? Well, actually I could, but I'll, we won't risk it right now. No reason to risk it. Eh, whatever, just do it. I'm gonna kill him. You're dead. You're dead, son. one he's what level is he she's level four and he level let's get this guy in there first you killed me okay uh see you tomorrow thanks bye